All right, guys, it's Bob here. Got an unboxing for you again, and this time it is the Lumia 930. Um, now, this uh, was from the people, or well, the very generous people um, over at uh, Connects who do the uh, the Lumia trials. And uh, you know, I've already had like a couple of other Lumias in for uh, <coughs> for review before, and this time they've sorted me out with the 930. So, uh, you know. Uh, quick look around it so uh, you know it's just the basic like you say I mean the boxes are slightly different now aren't they they've gone with this flatter uh, square style box and as soon as you open it up you're greeted with your 930 straight away there so we'll have a look at that in a moment quick look at all the other stuff so obviously under there you're gonna get your, uh, your quick guide it tells you how to set it all up and what have you because um, you can uh, I believe you can change the backs on these can't you which is uh, nice uh, so there you go. Um, now we've got the uh, USB charge lead there, which, yeah, there you go. So that's your uh, USB to mini USB. And they've sent me a Euro adapter, uh, not the normal sort of uh, UK one, but uh, it's obviously what they've got in for the trials at the moment. You can see Nokia on there. Um, I won't be using that anyway. I will just be using my generic lead that's already plugged in at the back of my desk. So let's uh, put all that to one side and we'll have a quick look at the device itself. Now I've already been using it and uh, I must admit uh, I actually really like this device. Uh, they've given me the orange one. Uh, you can see that uh, Carl Zeiss lens on the back of there. Uh, 20 megapixel I believe this one is and it's on the uh, Lumia 930 with that dual flash above it and a microphone and I'm assuming that's another microphone at the bottom so once I get into recording with it I'll be able to tell better you can see on the bottom here you've got your uh, CE marks uh, stamped in it um, charge port and over here you've got your volume rocker power button and camera button and on the top headphone jack now so far, I've, 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 I had a look at this. Now, I don't know whether this is the genuine one or because it's a trial unit that uh, they've just found something else to put in, but I'm not impressed with this here. I mean, it's it just sits back from the, the main surface of the phone. It's just, I don't know. It's I think it's a piece of plastic. I have taken it out and had a look. Um, and it's just, you, you know, it's just your SIM tray. Um, I don't know. It's just a big... So it could just be something that they found to put in it, or it could just be because it's a trial version, I'm not sure, but if that's the genuine one, I'm not actually impressed with that. Uh, so anyway, let's uh, power it on anyway, because I ha like I say, I have been using it. You can see it's all smeared with fingerprints. So we'll power it up and have a, have a quick look at it for you. <coughs> Sorry about the chest, and I apologize for the, uh, the poor lighting in here at the moment as well. So you can see, you, you press the power button, you get Nokia, and uh, there's your Windows logo because obviously it's running, running the uh, Windows mobile platform. And is it going to boot? Should do, because I know it's charged. And there we go. So, you get a, uh, a screen that can flick up. Now obviously you can allow things to um, sort of take over your home screen um, post pictures on it, things like that. And uh, and you can see the familiar sort of live tiles and things like that. A few additions now, of course, um, because we now get the, the Cortana, uh, the Nokia Beamer, and I think they, the, the, the two main ones that I've been sort of like playing around with. If we look at that camera, you can see it, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's really nice. It's um, I've only uh, taken the one sort of Instagram with photograph with it for, uh, so far, but uh, yeah, it's, it's it's actually gives uh, a nice photograph. Actually, it uh, it seemed a little. It could have just been me, but it seemed a little sort of uh, woolly around the edges, so to speak. But you can see it's sort of like you get the auto zoom feature comes in as you uh, take the shot there, and obviously you've got all your manual settings up above there and what have you. Um, if we go over to video mode and 
you know, I think it's quite a sharp image there. You can actually see the uh, the cloth uh, background there because I, uh, I'm filming over a cloth at the moment, and you can actually see all the weave in that, which is uh, very nice. And then you've got you can open any images you, you've taken. <laughs> it's one of my dog. Um, you can take um, any images you can open in the in the Nokia camera, and um, that's where, of course, you can edit them and play around with them a lot more. So if we come out of there, and now Cortana, uh, it's now I'm, I'm actually out of Wi-Fi range here, which is why, but uh, it can bring up all like your interests. Uh, so you can add like your new, uh, news that you want to read about, whether it be technology, food, whatever. Uh, music that you're interested about and you can go into Cortana and it'll give you all like the latest uh, updates and news in your feed and things like that so that's actually a really nice uh, I do like that very uh, interesting uh, piece of software that one Nokia Beena now this one it tells you there the easy and fun way to show your phone screen share yeah show your phone screen with family and friends on their web browser and it means that you can sort of like share it remotely you can send by email sms uh, social media or you can use like a nearby device so it's, it's a bit like uh, airplay i suppose on apple uh, but it, with the added thing that you can actually share a remote link so that's um, i mean i've not actually tried that yet so i'm going to definitely give that a try and uh, so i can get oh i've got a twitter notification notification so um you know uh, there will definitely be god do people still do that these days poke <laughs> um, so yeah uh, Instagram still seems to be in a beta on uh, on Windows Phone and as I've said before I don't really have a problem with the uh, the mobile software on a phone um, it's definitely something I would consider so um, you know I will get to grips with this and I will bring another um, another video with me uh, basically telling you my findings of this device and how I've got on with it but uh, size wise really nice um, feels a little sharp around the edges but um, it's definitely more grippy than the uh, the iPhones of course um, but it's, it's got that nice aluminium banding around the side I, I, I do like it a lot it's maybe a little on the square side because of course the other ones had the the much more rounded edges and they still retain the grippiness because they of course they were made from plastic so you know um, this is pretty much as it as it came I've only added one or two like the Instagram Twitter uh, Vine was already on there I've added the Facebook and things like that so you know it, it's it's pretty much as is that there's not a lot added to it so uh, yeah I'll come back with another video where in a couple of weeks guys and give you my full sort of rundown on it so uh, big thank you to connects for sending this out for me and uh, I'll get back to you in another video with it guys okay cheers see ya